It's winter time here at Robert Morris, and while that no normally means men's and women's hockey starting, with the cancellation of them earlier this year, there's been many attempts to try and raise money and raise awareness for these programs. Uh, there was one such event Thursday at the Robert Morris Island Sports Complex. I was able to head down and get interviews with Brett Kiesel, Ryan Malone, and a lot of other Pittsburgh celebrities to see how they were trying to save RMU hockey. Well, what it, what's going on here is we've got a lot of local celebrities, uh, you know, starting with Ryan Malone and he, he brought Brett Kiesel on board, Colby Armstrong, Neil Walker, Sean Sweezum, uh, Brianne McLaughlin, and then the on the bench guys into Pittsburgh, and they're making a video uh, to in support of our program and to help save Robert Morris hockey. They've been un outstanding. This is Ryan's uh, been. I, I can't say enough good things about. It. The support that Ryan Malone has, has done. This is this is his baby. This is his brainchild. I'm just along for the ride. I'm letting him run with this, and um, he's been great. And uh, to have these kind of celebrities out here in support of our program is outstanding. Celebrities down on the island included former Penguin Ryan Malone, Jacob Ardon, and Oli Poston from the hockey comedy duo On the Bench, and even former Pittsburgh Steeler Brett Kiesel, who, despite difficulty learning how to skate, loves how hockey has something for everybody. Well, I'm terrible at skating. Uh, it was really difficult, but also super humbling, you know, trying something new, going from a sport in football that I played for 13 years to a brand new sport that I knew nothing about was humbling, but I, I liked that challenge. I liked learning something new. And the great thing about hockey is it's for everybody. Like it's for men, it's for women, it's for kids, it's for kids in wheelchairs that can't walk. I mean, uh, it's for disabled kids. Like, there's so many avenues that this sport is great, which is unique to any other sport. One of the largest supporters of the campaign is former Pittsburgh Penguin Ryan Malone, who compared the way hockey's embraced now to his youth in Pittsburgh growing up in the 1980s. For me, it's, uh, it's for all, all the kids uh, growing up in Pittsburgh. Um, and I was one of those kids that uh, you know, we grew up here, there was no Division One hockey. There, there was literally like three rinks to, to, to go to. So, I mean, to see um, hockey and where it's uh, taken, um, I guess, to the, the city by storm when we finally have these Division One programs is, I feel, um, something that's very important, not only for the RMU program, but for uh, the, 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 the city. Speaking of young kids wanting to get into hockey, Jacob Ardown of On the Bench spoke on the importance of hockey. Yeah, there's a little gap out here. Basically, you just got to keep your head down and enjoy it, you know. Life's too serious. Hockey is where you can really let go and just be yourself. You know, you got a team. You always have your family with you. So if you're looking for a good spot to be in, just keep, keep having fun, you know. All roads lead to beer leagues, and, you know, it's totally worth it. Well, there hasn't yet been a confirmed number of donations and money. Head coach Derek Schooley said that following the Celebrity Game earlier this month, progress was being made. Well, obviously, you got the counter on there. Um, I think that the counter's up around $750,000. We have to get to $1.4 million cash, and then we have to get to $1.4 million in pledges. Um, I don't know the exact number at this time, just that I know that we're, we're getting there, and uh, we're moving along. We had a couple big donations after the, the celebrity game, and uh, we're, we're continuing to push. And, uh, an event like this with these guys here shows the, the support of the Pittsburgh sports community behind Robert Morris Hockey. To stay up to date with the latest in RMU hockey news, make sure to check out for ColonialSportsNetwork.com. For CSN, I'm Jonathan Hanna.